When the time comes to access Hike Central via the control client, you're going to need to get a copy of the software. One place that you can get the software very easily is from the web client. If you notice here on the right hand side at the bottom we have a download software section and here we see the Hike Central control client. If you go ahead and select it by clicking on it, at the bottom of your screen normally you will see a download bar where you can now run, save, or cancel this download. I'm going to choose save but I'm also going to choose save as to direct this download to a location that I want. This will normally open up a file explorer window where you can then navigate to the location where you want to save this copy. I'm going to put it in my Hike Vision downloads folder and I will go ahead and click on save and the download will begin. The amount of time it will take will depend on your internet connection. Once it's done, you might see a quick flash of a security scan, and then down at the bottom of my screen again, it's offering me to run this application, to open the folder where it's at, or to view all of my downloads. I'm gonna go ahead and click on Open Folder so that I can see the download, the date and time, it's an application, and it's approximately 181 megs. At this point, I could double click to run it to start the actual installation. I allow the installation to run, the installer begins, Choose the location where you want the installation to go. Begin the installation process. You'll see that we're installing some prerequisites. VS Player is being installed. And finally, once the installation is complete, we'll get the Install Shield Wizard complete message, and we can go ahead and click on Finish. For instructions on how to log into Hike Central via Control Client for the first time, be sure to check out our video on that subject.